Hello, boys and girls. My name is Holtzusi, and welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. Last time we have been working on this setup here, which is a second cooling setup. We're still filling up the polluted water tank, uh, but then. Uh, once we have enough water in here, uh, enough being 200 kilograms on the floor, we should be good to start that up. And uh, then there are a few other projects going on, like um, our volcano setup is still not working as the uh, uh, steam turbine room is just too hot for the uh, turbines to work um, continuously so i am cooling down the hydrogen up here with mixed results it gets heated up again because uh, of the hot steam down here uh, so that will not change as long as uh, the volcano is store is not dormant but at least we can get out all the, the iron that is in here uh, we just have to make sure that the, uh, the air pressure here is not too high so that's why uh, we also have to pump out uh, the, the steam. So that the iron volcano actually spits out liquid iron. That's not what happens if there is overpressure. So, yeah, that's going on as well. Then, here I have prepared a tank. Let's make a ladder down here and a ladder up there. And then we can collect the uh, that water from there as well that will hopefully become our uh, fish farm because initially I thought we will have it uh, over here but that's a minor volcano that I want to use at at some point so no good having a fish farm over here. So, do we have our... No, not yet. 188. Okay, now you can see uh, iron is being shipped out. And this one will be active for 17 more cycles. So that works out. Well, we can deconstruct that one which is standing in the hot water and therefore getting damaged. this and then of course we need no 
that door here and we can extend the wall all the way up to here and same on this side um, then we probably should dig out this here to make room for all the uh, water that will come in uh, we're still not there yet with the amount of uh, of water how much water do we still have here It's enough. Maybe it will not get uh, completely filled. But that's not the end of the world. Or the end of the asteroid. Or at the end of this series. We'll manage. We have survived numerous uh, failings, mostly on my part, sometimes also on the uh, WP part. Actually, uh, so far we have managed quite well. We only had one death, which is a bit surprising even to me, it's usually I have loads of dead duplicates, so seems like uh, I am better at managing their needs. Uh, plastic still 500, so uh, we cannot really uh, uh, extend the, uh, the tube. What we shall have here is solid one. So we can walk on it. Did we get the water? Not yet. Okay, but up here. Maybe let's switch to crude oil up the priority a bit. How are we looking iron wise? Don't have too much. Um then how are we looking wire wise? Um, we will plan a solar farm up here. And the solar panels only produce power when the sun is shining. So we will have times um, when there is no sun means no power and therefore we will have to have a bit of a, a battery set up up here to, to store it to store the, the, the power and these batteries need to be cooled. So I think the uh, right most that will be for cooling the batteries. Then this one is for the cooling system. And then these two uh, can be for other cooling needs up here. Yep, 
they deconstructed that tile so I can place one like this. And we have new things here in the printing pot. 500 kilo plastic, yes, take that. That brings us up to 900 kilo. So it's not an enormous amount. And here it looks like uh, we have the, the temperatures somewhat under control. 160, 150. Not ideal, but as long as the uh, volcano is not dormant, um, I cannot really expect um, um, any any uh, uh, massive cooling effect. Right. So what we will build up here is. A telescope. Um, but not out of, uh, of iron ore. Let's see if we make it out of um, old amalgam. That should be good enough. And this needs to have vision to the sky, so currently uh, no use. But let's let's put it in place anyway, um, because we have to, to plan things out here. And we need... oxygen up here which means another pipe that we have to lay the top Gas bridge. Um, the liquid pipe, no, the gas bridge, no, the gas pipe I want to deconstruct. Now I can do this bridge over. in a, a proper floor and take that pipe further up and up 
switch sides. We go in here and then do this. Don't need that anymore. it completely done it's a bit of an oil spill here um, then of course we will need power an easy thing. gate this up and then bring this up to Is that we should then be able to control our doors because these can detect incoming uh, objects uh, and if they detect something we can close the doors however before we can actually do that we need to power the doors otherwise they op uh, open and close just too slowly uh, for it to be effective and um, as you can see uh, on top here there is a pile of regolith when the doors open that will fall down and pile up here so we will need a set up with robo miners down here to take care of that and those will need cooling so you can see uh, how this all comes together eventually uh, but i think we are still a way off um, Probably until we get to that point, this 
uh, volcano has gone dormant and become active again uh, hopefully at that point we will have this setup here fixed but this is all for now so i hope you enjoyed this episode of oxygen not included and join me next time for more or less oxygen included or not goodbye